In this video, we are going to discuss the anatomy associated with the gluteus maximus muscle of the gluteal region or buttock region. There are three gluteal muscles, the gluteus maximus, the gluteus medius, and the gluteus minimus. The gluteus maximus is the largest and most superficial of the three gluteal muscles. Origin and insertion. The gluteus maximus muscle originates from the gluteal surface of the ilium, lumbar fascia, sacrum, and the sacrotuberous ligament. The lower deep quarter of the gluteus maximus muscle is inserted into the gluteal tuberosity of the femur. The upper and larger portion of the muscle, together with the lower portion, inserts into the iliotibial band of the fascia lata, which passes across the greater trochanter. The fibers of the gluteus maximus muscle run downward and laterally. The gluteal lines are three bony ridges on the gluteal surface of the ilium or part of the pelvic bone that serve as attachment points for the gluteal muscles. Part of the origin of the gluteus maximus is from the gluteal surface of the ilium, which is posterior to the posterior gluteal line. The gluteal tuberosity of the femur provides insertion to the lower part of the gluteus maximus. The gluteus maximus also inserts into the iliotibial band of the fascia lata. The blood supply of the gluteus maximus comes from the superior and inferior gluteal arteries. The nerve supply to the gluteus maximus muscle is given by the inferior gluteal nerve, L5, S1, S2 nerve roots. The gluteus maximus muscle is mainly supplied by the S1 nerve root. The gluteus maximus plays a role in maintaining body balance and coordination. It contributes to the shape and appearance of the buttocks. The primary function of the gluteus maximus muscle is to extend the hip joint, moving the thigh backward. This action is essential for activities such as climbing stairs or running. The gluteus maximus also contributes to external rotation of the hip or turning the thigh outward. This is involved in movements such as squatting and kicking. Some fibers of the gluteus maximus assist in adducting the hip, bringing the thighs closer together. Thank you for watching this video. This concludes our video on the anatomy associated with the gluteus maximus muscle. We will discuss other important anatomy associated with the gluteal region in additional videos.